Three, two, one. Oh dear. Robert wanted to know what would happen if we mixed molten salt with either liquid nitrogen or dry ice. Well, today is not the day for the liquid nitrogen test, but it is the day to see what happens if we pour molten salt onto dry ice. Ooh. That looks toasty. Let's see how well molten salt pours out of a crucible. Huh. Well, it's cooled down. It certainly bubbled a good amount, but it didn't react horrendously violently at all, at least not yet. I guess it's still possible to get there, but even the salt that's just on our pavers has cooled down to being solid. Looks like our salt inside our dry ice has as well. Let's see if we can tip that out. Well, there you go, a nice solid chunk of salt right there. 